exciting announcement. We moved because we are gonna build a house. We're gonna build a house that's gonna have a nice kitchen in it. So for the next few months, this is gonna be the kitchen that we're gonna film in. And today we're making guacamole at Molly. grandma's house. Yay, guacamole. grandma. Guacamole. We have an avocado. Do you guys know guacamole is made from avocados? Yep. So you gotta make sure that you have a soft one. This one's kind of soft and softer in that spot because the kids kept dropping it. We're gonna cut it with a big chef knife and I have a cover on it and this is a Victorian ox and a lot of chef knives are really expensive. This one is about $30 and it is super sharp and it's one of my favorites. So I will have a link to it. So we've got the avocado. Yep. With the adult's help, because you have a sharp knife, you're just gonna cut it in That's half. That's how I wanted to do it. Mm, this is kind of scary for a little kid. Okay, then you open it up and you hope that you have a good avocado. Now watch this. This is how we get the seed out. We put it down safely and we go really fast and we stab it. Do you see that? And then we can twist the seed right out. What? Just like that. What? Is that cool? Yeah. Okay. That's what I was gonna say. So cool. Okay, so then we're just gonna get the seed off of the knife, and then we're done with our knife. We're gonna put it away, we're gonna throw our seed away, and I like to keep my knife covered up, but we're gonna wash it first. Now, we have a spoon, and we're gonna scoop it out. Can you scoop it out, Kate? Scoop it, scoop it. And Jane, you can do that one. And then with a fork, we're just gonna smash it. And this is why it's important to have a soft avocado you can smash it really easy with a fork. And if you like a chunky guacamole, you don't have to smash it too much. You can dice it up. We like it just smashed. So this is just an avocado. To make guacamole, you need to add a few things too. Okay, drink that. So we're gonna put about a teaspoon of lime juice. And then I just have some garlic salt. Do you want to sprinkle some in? Just a little sprinkle. I don't think any came out. Okay. We need like that much. That much. And I use so that's garlic salt. This is cumin, ground cumin. That one's a little trickier to come out. Okay, so about that much. Um, a little bit more salt. This is my cool little salt shape. Salt. Grinder. I bought some kosher salt. Just a minute, Kate. There's some kosher salt inside of that. And then we have a black pepper grinder. This is just a McCormick one. I like this because you can do different types if you want it really coarse, so big pieces. Okay, this you have to hold upside down and twist it. Wait, you hold, I'll hold it, you twist. And that's all I do for my guacamole. Stir it all in really good so all of it gets all the flavors. And then, this is the best kept secret. I don't know, you'll have to check in your area if you have these. These are called Juanitas tortilla chips. Mmm, that's perfect. Okay, thanks for watching Half Pint Cooking. Don't forget to subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and share with all your friends. Today we are gonna make Faka Guacamole. 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 Guacamole.